been a year of launches for Bajaj Auto and the motorcycle maker is adding to the festive cheer with a new range of cruisers. Bajaj Auto's premium cruiser, the Avenger, is one of its oldest product lines and has been a good success story thanks to the steady stream of niche customers it appeals to. Yet in all its 10 years, the Avenger has been upgraded only twice. But now, realizing that the Avenger can do a lot more to its fortunes, Bajaj has replaced the old Avenger 220 by the new Avenger series which has three variants. The 220cc models, the Street and the Cruiser, come with a price tag of 84,000 rupees, while the new Avenger Street 150 is the most affordable premium motorcycle today at 75,000 rupees. With a brand new portfolio in place, Bajaj expects to sell 20,000 units a month of the Avenger series, a three-fold increase from the current monthly sales of 3,500 units. Experts believe that the target is highly ambitious, but say the company could be placing its biggest bet on the Street 150, which offers a design and style unlike rivals in the same category. For instance, Honda and Yamaha, which offer naked sport bikes. The Avenger is part of the premium motorcycle segment, which shrank 7 to 8 percent in fiscal 2016. Now, with a new makeover, Bajaj is hoping that the Avenger series will not just help in expanding the premium motorcycle segment in India, but at the same time, the Avenger will also help Bajaj in expanding its domestic market share from the current 18 percent to 23 percent by the end of this fiscal, as the company had projected earlier. 22 percent market share that we've been talking about at the end of the year, I think depends on many products other than the Avenger. But let me talk about the sports motorcycle market of which this is a part. You're right, it has been shrinking this year, but it's not been shrinking more than the industry shrinkage. So it is effect, in effect merely following an overall industry pattern where the motorcycle industry this year has been shrinking. Uh, what do we intend to do with this? Clearly, this is designed to expand the universe for Bajaj Auto and the industry. Bajaj will also export the Avenger Trio, but says the immediate focus is to meet domestic demand. To this end, the company has already begun the process of scaling up production capacity at its chalk and plant, an exercise that is said to cost the company 350 crore rupees. In Mumbai, Farah Bukwala, Vora.